welcome back and if you're new welcome my name is nikki i hope that you will consider subscribing i upload every tuesday thursday and sunday with bonus uploads i'm currently uploading daily because there's just there's just too much going on in the beauty world i'm freaking out friends i'm losing my mind and i'm spending too much money so i hope that you will consider subscribing i also have two other channels if you're interested i always link them down below one is the vlog channel it's just my life hanging out dating i really don't know how to just you guys know what a vlog channel is i vlog my life you know dating work my shih tzu family friends and then i also have a reselling channel so if you didn't know i sell clothing and a whole bunch of other stuff it's one of my part-time jobs on ebay poshmark and amazon so if you're interested in reselling or you have no idea what it's about and you want to find out i talk about how much i make i give you selling tips i link that down below this is something i actually thrifted this is not usually my vibe that's a lie. I love glitter. I love sparkle, but I don't wear sequins unless, honestly, I'm filming or it's New Year's. But you guys, this is a 100% silk handmade shirt. It's not my size. It's a size large. I was just like, okay. And I also have on like Minnie Mouse pajama bottoms. Don't mind that. But I, had, I was like, I have to film in this. This is on sale on my Poshmark. Um, don't worry, I clean everything. Although this one is vintage, so it does have like some interior stains. So when I'm selling things on Poshmark or eBay, I just notate it, but I was like, I have to film in this. It's beautiful and it just feels so nice because it's sequins and silk. So anyways, I know I look like a 90s pink disco ball, but I don't care. Link to the reselling channel down below. Today is all about Ulta, friends. I have officially found Ulta's 2019 Black Friday ad. So I did a video just like three days ago reviewing what I thought would be on sale for Ulta's Black Friday and just telling you like what I would buy, what I'm not gonna buy. But now I have the official 2019 Black Friday ad. I'm gonna put pictures of everything on the screen. Let's go through it. I'd love to hear what you guys are going to buy or not going to buy, so let me know. I also did a Sephora Black Friday video if you're interested, and I have a Cyber Week video. I'm telling you friends, this is the time of year that I save up for and I stock up. I usually buy a lot of high-end purchases because you can save money and I buy my gifts. So I'll leave a link to those videos down below, but let's jump into it, friend. Okay, so first up, the hours of operations. I'm not gonna go into, you guys know how I feel about retail stores opening on Thanksgiving, but Ulta will be open, friends. Thanksgiving, Thursday, 5 p.m. to 1 a.m. Why? Why? Can any of you let me know, or any of you, after you have your Thanksgiving dinner, if you celebrate Thanksgiving, are you rushing out to Ulta? I sure won't be. Absolutely not. No, ma'am. No, thank you. So, I don't know. I'd just love to hear that. Are any of you going on actual Thanksgiving? I have done that in the past. I think like three years ago, I did go on Thanksgiving evening, and it was completely empty. In the middle of Los Angeles, I went to the one in West Hollywood, which is a very busy location. Nobody was in there. So maybe you'll get lucky and nobody will be in there. I don't know. But they're also open Friday, so Black Friday. <laughs> what? So they're closing for four hours because they're open Thursday, Thanksgiving, 5 p.m. to 1 a.m. Friday, 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. Those poor associates. But again, maybe some retail people want to work on Thanksgiving. We talked about that in the last Ulta video. And then Saturday, basically back to normal hours, 9 to 9, 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. Um, I got this new phone case. How do we feel about it? I got it on Amazon. I can link it down below. I kind of like it. All right, so let's jump in. First up, Ulta Beauty Collection. They always have these little kits on sale. You guys said you want a video, a full review video on Ulta's makeup collection, so I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna go and buy some of this stuff. So it's $14.99. I've tried some of their, I haven't tried some of their shadows, but I've tried their concealer and I wasn't that impressed. But this gift set will be on sale for $14.99 and you do get a lot. I feel like these sets are really good for people that just wanna play around with makeup, wanna like just test it out, or maybe they're beginners because I don't know about that shadow quality. Let's see, Living Proof will be 50% off. Wow, everything? Oh, no, 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 sorry. Just their Instant Defrizzer will be on sale for $14.50. And then It's a 10, I've never heard of that. I guess it's leave-in conditioners, those will be 50% off. Um, if you see me looking down, I'm just looking at my laptop. Too Faced 
lashes and lips. I told you guys, Too Faced is always on sale. Sephora is also having Too Faced on sale um, for Black Friday. So it looks like this kit is $16. Didn't I bet you guys 50 bucks in the last Ulta video? I said, I guarantee you Morphe will be on sale. Do we remember saying that? Do you remember? I can't speak properly yet. I just got lip fillers for the first time. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. And so, yeah, my lips just don't really work. Like, I spit a lot. I stammer a lot. I'm still, this is like five days after, so just bear with me. But I told you guys Morphe would be on sale. So this is the Morphe Catch My Eye brush set. So it looks like you get three, six, you get six um, brushes for $19, which isn't bad. I'm just drinking hot water. It's a wonderful rainy day here in Los Angeles. It doesn't rain off. In the winter, we get like two, three weeks of rain and then that's our winter. So I think it's gonna rain on Thanksgiving, which mm, I'm not the biggest fan of. I like to be really active on holidays. Like usually my mom and I, we literally will go hike like three miles on Thanksgiving morning because that's the type of people we are. But I guess this year we'll just go to the gym. But we really, in Southern California, we need the rain, so I welcome it. But I'm very hit or miss on Morphe. Some of the brushes I've purchased have lasted me honestly for years and some of them literally disintegrate in like two seconds. Let me know your thoughts on Morphe down below. And how are we feeling about the Jaclyn Cosmetics holiday release? I'm just kind of over talking about her. I did a video saying why I just didn't trust her anymore. And if you're new around here, I was one of the biggest Jaclyn Hill fans. I can leave a link to some of the videos down below. So I was thinking, should I even do a video on Jacqueline, the holiday launch? I don't know. Let me know what you want down below. All right, so there's gonna be things for $5, stocking stuffers. It's really hard to see because the ad is small, so I can't even like tell it, but there's gonna be a lot of stuff for five. Oh, you guys, you guys know I'm a big fan. I know some people don't like like the clip-on, like the glue-on nails, but those are gonna be $5 and under. So they're gonna have an Ulta set that's $5 for nail polish. Ooh, that's kinda cute, actually. It's called Make It Sweet, but they're clip-on like nails. Looks like those are gonna be $5 and under. Guys, they're gonna have some good deals. $10 and under, it looks like Real Techniques will be on sale. Bedhead will be on sale for $10 and under. Does that say Kylie? It, the ad is like so small. Hopefully I can make the picture bigger for you guys. Um, and what else? Let me zoom in. Maybe that'll help. Real Techniques. I can't see the rest, but I'll put a picture on the screen. And then 20 and under, Bare Essentials. I'm sorry, Bare Minerals. I told you guys, Bare Minerals, always on sale. Uh, First Aid Beauty, the Radiance Pads. I've tried that. I like it. Their cream will be on. I'm a big fan of First Aid Beauty. I did a whole video on the line reviewing a lot of their products. So if you're interested in that, I'll leave a link to it down below. And then they're gonna have a bunch of stuff that's 50% off. So the Urban Decay Naked 3 palette will be 50% off. I know that's a holy grail palette for a lot of people. Um, it Cosmetics, OPI, I told you guys. Last year they had OPI on sale. This year, the year they'll have it. It's a great time to stock up. Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Cyber Week. Great time to stock up on things like your favorite nail polishes because you get them 50% off. And honestly, I feel like a lot of nail polish is severely overpriced. I do like OPI, but I'd much rather pay $5 for it than $10 for it. Anastasia, that's so funny. We were just saying Anastasia was on sale last year. They must just be trying to like clear out their glow kits. So the glow kits will be on sale for 40% uh, 40 off. So I think they're usually 40, so they'll be closer to like 20, what is that, like 25? bucks. I like their glow kits actually a lot. Ooh, our Dell lashes are going to be 40% off. Okay, I was saying I may not go to Ulta on Thanksgiving, but maybe I will. <laughs> After I just was like, I will not be shopping on Thanksgiving. There's just no way I'm not going to do it. And I'm like, well, maybe I could just pop in for like a couple hours. <laughs> I'm a mess. This is so funny, guys. We reviewed, so we reviewed in the last video Alta's Black Friday sale last year, but they're having like some of the similar products, like the same products almost. This Origins gift set, they had Origins gift set on sale last year. It's gonna be on sale this year for 40% off. Also, 
Um, looks like they'll have some Chi on sale. They had that on sale last year. So kind of the similar products. All right, mascaras. I told you guys, Black Friday, you need to listen to your friend Nikki. Did I not tell you that Black Friday is a great time to stock up on mascaras? So all of these mascaras will be $10 each. The Tarte, Man Eater, the Urban Decay, Perversion, uh, Buxom, Smashbox, Lorac, all on sale for $10. Um, Mario Badescu. Here's a fun fact. I was telling you guys in the last Ulta video, this shirt is kind of itchy, actually. I think the sequins, I have really sensitive skin. Um, there's some drama with Mario Badescu. I didn't know. Like, apparently their products aren't that good for your face. Let me know in the comments down below. Um, Tarte is going to have their eye and cheek set for $12. And then, what is this? They look like donuts. It's a uh, I Heart Revolution donut tray. So is that makeup? And then a Revlon Bedhead Hot Tools Hair Dryers for $39.99. Ooh. They're going to have Caroline Herrera. I've never smelled that perfume on sale for $25. And Juicy Couture perfume for $32. And then looks like Anastasia's Vault. It's usually $84. will be on sale for $49. And it looks like here you get a free gift. If you buy, I can't see because the ad is so small, but it looks like you get, I'll put it on the screen. Like you get free candles if you purchase a beauty gift box, which I can't really read, but I'll leave it on the screen. So let me know friends what you're going to be picking up down below, what you're not going to be picking up. I really want to know, are you guys going to shop in the store on Thanksgiving? I'm just curious, like how many people actually go on Thanksgiving? Let's talk about some products. So all of these, full disclosure, I always tell you guys when things are sent to me for free, this is not sponsored, but these were sent to me for free. Lancome, you guys know I'm a big fan of Lancome. I've done many videos on their products. Was nice enough to send me their Energy DV. I hope I'm saying that right. It's Energy D-E-V-I-E. So this is an exfoliating, it's an illuminating, purifying, exfoliating mask. This, this looks so cool and it smells like lime. Here's the thing, I used to this like last year. It smells like lemon lime. I know some people don't like scent in their skincare. I don't mind it. I, you don't need it, right? It's additive. You don't need it, it's not necessary. But it does have a scent. It literally smells like lemon and lime mixed together. So, and it has these little like micro things in them, like little micro beads to help to exfoliate. I don't remember what I thought about it. I think I liked it, so I'm gonna reuse this. God, this feels nice. I love Lancome's packaging. I just, I know this is gonna sound sponsored, it's not, but I feel like they're so underrated here on YouTube. A lot of people don't talk about them, and some of some of my favorite beauty products are from them. So I, I always tell you guys, though, with skincare, I have to give it a month before I can give you like a full, full review. But let me know if you want a one brand review on, on Lancome, because I've been using them for years, so I feel like I could give you a, like a detailed review on a lot of their range. I actually have right here under my Christmas tree. Yes, you guys, I give myself Christmas presents. I have Lancome's, this is their holiday glam collection gift set that has some of my favorites. So maybe after Christmas, I told you guys, in January of 2020, get ready. You're gonna have a lot of one brand videos because you guys seem to like that. I did it for Caudalie. I know you guys say I say it wrong, whatever. Caudalie, First Aid Beauty, I'll link those down below. I always say I'll link a million videos down below. Will it happen? I don't know, girl, but I'm gonna try. Um, so you can expect Lancome, we're gonna do Clarence, I wanna do ColourPop, we're gonna do a lot, okay. Next up, from Fresh. I could actually do a one brand review on Fresh because I've used a lot of their stuff. So they sent, this is the Peony collection. So this is the Peony Instant, I feel like I say that weird. Instant Brightening, the Serum, and the Night Treatment Mask, which I really need. So I have done a pretty good job, I think, of getting rid of a lot of my acne. But now I have like a lot of acne scarring um, and yeah, just like black marks. So my esthetician was telling me that I need to be using things like this that help um, with texture and even skin tone because I feel like my skin tone's not really even right now. Let's see what this smells like. I'm interested. Oh, that's like a, oh, it's very light. It almost doesn't have a scent at all. It's a, like a very, very light, authentic rose scent. I don't like when skincare has that very synthetic 
rose scent. Like this actually smells like if you put your nose up to a real rose or a flower, or not even a rose, maybe a peony. I can't remember what, oh I love peonies. It actually smells like if you put your nose up to a real peony. I feel like I say that really weird. The lip injections are literally making me sound crazy. And then this one is the serum. So when do you use this? After cleansing, apply a thin veil on face and neck. I don't feel anything. There. And it has a pump. So I will use these probably tonight and let you know what I think. I will keep you posted. You guys know skincare, I have to I have to use it for a month. But I can give you like initial first impressions. So let me know down below, one, are you going into the store on Black Friday? Are you gonna be shopping in the stores? Are you going to Ulta or Sephora or neither? What do you plan on picking up? If you haven't seen my Cyber Week video, check it out right here.